Often in an InDesign document, you will want design elements to appear on every page. Using Master Pages makes this easy. The Pages window shows you the pages in your document, but it also shows Master Pages. The Master Pages for this document show by clicking the Master Preview. And this is a spread that shows the right and left pages. On the master document, whatever you create will appear throughout the pages assigned to the master document. You can see that all the pages in my document are assigned the A master. So if I want a page layout for my magazine to include a color bar, at the bottom. I'll draw that here. And I'll draw that here. And notice by looking at the icons of my pages, those design elements appear on every page. If I wanted a small blue square in the top right of each page. I could do that. Move over to the other page in the spread. And now you'll notice in my pages all of them have a blue square in the top and left. This allows you to create a general outline of design for a document that you're working on without having to do this for all the pages. So by going through my document, I can see now that those design elements are consistent throughout every page of the document. The good part about using this method is, let's say your client wants the bar at the bottom to be green instead of black. If you were working on a 32-page document and did not use master pages, you would have to go to each page individually and change that color. But by using master pages, we can simply click on the master, choose the frame at the bottom, Change that to green. Go back to the pages. And now you'll see that every page has a green bar at the bottom. Working with master pages is beneficial because you can also create new master pages. And by default, it will give the prefix as the next letter for your master page. And notice now that I have a B master page. And for this master page, I am going to create an ellipse tool. And I'm going to put a red circle in the top left. I'm going back to my pages. I have a master A and a master B. Let's say that for pages four and five, I would like to incorporate the B master. So I simply check that. Apply master to pages and choose B master. Same thing here. Select page 5, right click, apply master to pages, choose B, click OK. And now in my pages palette, you'll see that pages 4 and 5 have been assigned the B master page. 
you can create as many master pages as you would like and apply them to the different pages within your document to create a standard and changeable layout for your document.